Okay, so one last video today. Um, I'm kind of hoping that I can talk fast because this one's a bit long. Um, I may shorten it after one to skip a few questions. So, um, it's kind of a tag. It's called questions you've probably never been asked on YouTube. And according to the first 10, yeah, never asked these ones before, so this will be fun. I've also got my mic set up. I've got my little light, I've got my fish eye thingy magic on, and yeah, let's go. So, question one What is your favourite candle scent? I like anything that's berry flavoured, like really sweet berries, like strawberries and raspberries and everything. Um, lavender is a good one. Lavender, okay, lavender, yep, lavender. <laughs> I think lavender for favourite. <laughs> Um, what female celebrity do you wish was your sister? Um, the only person I can think of right now is Nina Dobrev. So, guess it'd have to be her. <laughs> what male celebrity do you wish was your brother? Uh... I guess if I couldn't have him as a boyfriend, I guess Dylan O'Brien. Because <laughs> he is such a nice guy. I mean, so funny and sweet and hilarious and just so good in what he does. So, yeah. Four. How old do you think you'd be when you get married? Is this right? No idea. <laughs> no idea. Um, do you know a hoarder? My grandmother was a ginormous hoarder. Um, can you do a split? Used to, almost can now. And when I'm at Nikki's, my friend Nikki's, and I slide on her wooden floor with my socks, then yes, I can. <laughs> Although it does really hurt. Um, how old were you when you learned to ride a bike? Six. I think I was six. I was very very just defiant could not be bothered to ride a bike I was like I can walk it's fine I don't need it sorry um how many oceans have you swam in two I think yeah two one in the west of Scotland one in the east of Scotland um how many countries have you been to Scotland England, France, Germany, not Germany, Spain, <laughs> Lanzarote technically but still, um, four, uh, is anyone in your family, farm, far, fa, fa, the, is anyone in your family in the army, I have no idea, I don't think they are, um, what would you name your daughter if you had one? I like Alisa, which is spelled A L Y L I S A, um, which is Alisa. And then for um, number 12, is what would you name a son? And that would be Hunter. I don't know, I've just always clicked with those two. What was your favourite TV show when I was a child? Now, depending what you mean by child here, if you mean toddlers, it was Teletubbies. Um, if you mean preteens, teens if it was, well, like before preteens teens even, it'd be like Young Dracula, and then like pre-teenage, like 12-ish, then it'd be, Supernatural, or TVD, no TVD didn't come out for about when I was 12, or did it? I don't know. I'm very confused. I can't remember how what year it was when I was twelve. Sorry. Okay. Um what did I dress up for Halloween when I was eight? Witch, maybe? Princess maybe? Vampire maybe? No idea. I think it was Red Riding Hood actually. Now that I think about it. Or that might have been six. 
I don't know, I've got a bad memory. Have you read any of the Harry Potter Hunger Games or Twilight series? None, because they're too long and I prefer to watch a movie. Would you rather have an American accent or a British accent? Can I have a bit of both? Does that count? Because there's a couple of times that I go into American and there's a couple of times that I go into complete British and then, yeah, I'm all over the place. So probably a bit of both. Did your mum go to college? Yes. <laughs> and uni. <laughs> uh, my mum went to the original Lauder Tech, which was Kenrigi College, which is now Halbeath Fife College in Dunfermline in Scotland. So yeah, she definitely went to college, considering how smart she is. Um, are your grandparents still married? Technically, because they're all dead. Um, have you ever taken a karate lesson? No. Do you know who Kermit the Frog is? Yeah, the you the really cute suck. Um, what is your first amusement park you've ever been to? Disneyland. Does that count? Um, what language besides your native language would you like to be fluent in? English. I tend to speak gibberish, so probably English. <laughs> um, do you spell the colour grey as G or E E E Y even? Or yeah, the first one. The other one's just spelled with an E. Is your father bald? No. Do you know triplets? No. Do you prefer Titanic or the Notebook? Titanic. Uh, have you ever had Indian food? Yes. What's the name of your favourite restaurant? Are we still talking Indian food or are we talking normal food? Because I can go for a few here. If we're talking Chinese, it's the village tantori down in Concordant. If we're talking chippy, it's the Lados in Concordant. If we're talking Indian, it's the Gonar in Larbar. If we're talking fish, um, if we're talking fish and chips, I've already done that one. Um, if we're talking grocery shop, it's probably Tesco. Um, if we're talking fast food restaurant, it's probably KFC. And then if you're talking sandwich shop, it's probably Subway. So, yeah. Have you ever been to the Olive Garden? No. Do you belong? Do you belong to any warehouse stores? No. I think it's meaning to have like a club card to there. No, I don't. Um, would your parents? What would your parents have named me if I was an opposite gender? I wasn't allowed to be an opposite gender. My mum said, my dad said, sorry, it has to be a girl or a dog. If it's a boy, the girl on the roof rack. Of course he was joking, but at the same time, he refused to pick out any boys' names. So <laughs> I had to be a girl. <laughs> um, if you had a nickname, what is it? Well, Nick. Nicky. Who's your favourite person in the world? Hmm. If you're talking celeb, Joe Sugg. Talking normal human being. Jenny or my mum? If you're talking animal, Lucky and Lara. Cause I can't choose between my dogs. Would you rather live in a rural area or in the suburbs? That's an American. I'm confused. I'm carrying on. Can you whistle? Barely. <laughs> Very sorry for your ears there. Um, do you sleep with a nightlight? No, but at the minute I've got my lanterns on. Because I like them and they're really cute. <laughs> and they make me feel a bit Christmassy sometimes. Uh, do you eat breakfast every morning? No. Um, what medications do you have? Painkillers, 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 painkillers. <laughs> and more painkillers. Um, how many times have you been to hospital? Let's not count that. Have you seen Finding Nemo? Yes, and I don't like Finding Nemo. I'm very sorry, I know you want to shoot me now, but I don't like Finding Nemo. I know. I'm sorry. Don't hate me. Um, 
Where do you buy your jeans? Primark, New Look, or Debenhams? Depending. Um, what was the last compliment you got? I like your hair. <laughs> yeah. Um, do you usually remember your dreams in the morning? Yes. What flavour tea do you enjoy? Enjoy PG Tips Original. Um, how many pairs of shoes do you currently own? Over 20. I'm not counting after that. Um, what religion are you raising your children to practice? Absolutely none. Because I do not care anything about religion. I'm like, do you know what? I believe what I want to believe. I'm not focusing on anything. I'm not pinpointing anything. If I want to believe in... I don't know. If I want to believe in a dolphin that can fly, I'll believe in that. <laughs> not that I do. But still. Um, how old were you when you find out the Santa wasn't real? Oh, the Santa's not real. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I was about eight. No, I'm kidding. But, still. I went along with the rouge for a bit. Um, why do you have Tumblr? I was bored. I got very bored. Yeah. Okay, so this is now 12 minutes long. So yeah, I'm going to go. Yeah, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, I have no idea how many questions this was, so if you want to count them, let me know in the comments below how many it was. <laughs> and yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.